preparing for an emergency. A rescue, even if it is conducted by experienced divers, can fail if it is not well organized. Organizing and planning in advance are the basis for a safe and successful rescue operation. Advanced planning and organization means gathering together all the necessary information. For instance, how far is the dive site from the road or shore, particularly if you are using a boat, or what emergency rescue services are available in that area in case of a diving incident. Check the sea and weather forecasts and find out if the area is affected by currents or tides. Check that the diver's preparation, physical condition and equipment are suitable for the dive being planned. Draw up a list of useful telephone numbers and other necessary information needed for making an emergency call and place a copy near the radio and another inside the first aid kit together with an up-to-date list of the nearest operational hyperbaric chambers. However, knowing who to call is not enough. You also need to be organized to do so. So find out where the nearest public telephones are, even if you have a mobile cell phone, because it might not be possible to receive a signal in that particular area. Before every dive, you must make sure there is a valid telephone card in the first aid kit and that the cell phone is fully charged. The person staying on the surface must have immediate access to the cell phone and know how to use it. On a boat, the main means of communication is the onboard radio. Check that the radio is set to channel 16, the appointed channel for emergencies. Check that the oxygen equipment is complete and working. Administering oxygen requires special training and your instructor will be able to give you other information regarding the local laws so as to avoid any legal problems concerning its use. The first aid kit must be kept in a cool dry place, preferably dark and dust free, which is immediately accessible and known to everyone. Remember that in many countries only qualified doctors or paramedics may use certain equipment and give medication to others. This may be because of the skill required or for legal reasons.